Hey. Hey, where are you? I haven't seen you yet. Did you leave? No, not yet. I'm still in the dressing room. Well, get up here. I need your help with something. I'll be out in a few. Okay, hurry. There she is! There's the star. <laughs> that was so great. Oh, thanks, Jenna. You're going to the party tonight, right? I can give you a ride if you like. I forgot there was a party tonight. It's closing night. There's always a party. Yeah, but when the group decided to have one three weeks into rehearsal, it kind of messed everything up for me. Well, now you remember. And you're definitely invited. So you're going? I'm not sure. Oh, I'm sure. You're going. Emma said that she needed my help. Is it getting to the party? I highly doubt it. Well, then it can wait. Come on, it's our last party. Everyone's gonna be there if they're not there already. Look, I'd hate to miss it, but I gotta help Emma. There you are. Hey! Sorry to keep you waiting. No worries. <laughs> I see you're still in costume. Yeah. I can't seem to get it off. Okay, well, you're never going to believe this. We have an apartment. What? Seriously? Yeah, the one right near campus. The owner called back and said we can come sign for it tonight. Then we'll officially be college roommates. I can drive us over. Tonight? Yes, indeed. Did he say that it needed to be done tonight? Well, he said it's probably best. The sooner the better, right? Yeah. Great. What? Well... There's a cast party tonight. Lexi, this is important. I'm aware. We're saving a hell of a lot of money living off campus than on, and even more with this place and one across town. Well, in that case, we should just live at home. I know you don't mean that. No, I don't. The owner's never even met you yet. This would be the perfect time. The perfect time would be another time. Look, I like to have as much fun as you do, but you'll see all these people many times before we graduate. You can say goodbye then. Not Brendan Mallory. What? what? Brendan Mallory? The actor? He's my cousin. He went to the show tonight and he'll be at the party. Says he wants to talk with you. Me specifically? You especially. About what? All he said was about your future. You're lying. Why would I lie about that? He's been on Broadway and he actually thinks I'm good? Now you can't pass up that conversation now, can you? I mean, who knows where that would lead? We already have a plan. Is it the right one, though? She needs to utilize her talent. Lexi, we've been planning this for months. Who even knows what this guy has to offer you? This could be something good. It could also be nothing. For all we know, he may just want to say, great job, kid, keep at it. This is about my future. You already have one. Look, I owe a lot to you. You were there for me more times than I can count. Stress-filled nights, fights with my parents. When John and I broke up, I love you and you're talented. I can't deny that, but the last thing that I want to have happen is for you to be stuck in a never-ending loop of waitress jobs and thinking to yourself, that apartment was really nice, better than this. 